Elected officials everywhere weigh important decisions, but in tonight's installment of our series 2500 Below, we reveal the unique challenges in leading Missouri's smallest towns. Cami Bates' Matt McCabe spoke with emerging community leaders in the town of Brunswick about the issues they face. A city on the banks of the Grand River is an exceedingly quiet place. But its location is rivaled by dangers threatening its home on the map. Just three years ago, the town looked like this. It's come a long way since then, and this spring, three of its residents fought to push its recovery in a new direction. Maybe I should do this and, and just see what happens. If you're going to do something, you might as well go all in. Here, I can make a difference, and that's what I want to do. For a mayoral race in a town of 800, the election was competitive. The former city clerk... There's a couple hot topics. A 25-year-old salesman... Brunswick's not just a retirement town. ...and a longtime local business owner. We have a great way of life here. And when election night came... The candidates learned who would lead the community for the next two years. Okay, the mayor, Young, got 46. Diane Rice, a write-in candidate, won the night with 97 votes. Whether I win or lose is inconsequential. It's whether I tried. I decided that if I didn't even try when I felt like I could help some of the issues that Brunswick has, then I would, I would, be, I would feel worse than if I run and if I'm not elected. Small town leadership isn't easy. For Diane, it means finding ways to do more with less. Yeah. The city's sewer systems and roads have cost the city in repairs from the 2019 flood. The town's empty police department will hopefully soon gain an officer. And summer joys and leisures also bubble up as important spending priorities. I, for one, I, I think it's a good example for my family, for my kids, as they get older and make lives of their own. You know, it's not always convenient. It's not always about whether you think you have time, but if you see a need and you see that you have the opportunity to help fill it, I think it's, a, it's I think you need to try. Meeting a small town's loudest issues is a busy job for local officials, but it takes an entire community to preserve itself and push for the change it wants. Matt McCabe, Cam U8 News, Brunswick. Rice is now about two months into her term as mayor for the town, and we have a more detailed explanation of the issues and thoughts from the other candidates on our website. There you will also find a full section of our other 2,500 below stories. Again, that's all on KOMU.com.